what's up people on YouTube and welcome to definitely the first thing I'm recording in this series. Is that convincing guys? Do you think they'll know? They'll never know about the other thing that happened. Uh, but we're going to be playing as ECW in 1996. Now I'm getting into playing as owners but I'm, or as a booker, excuse me, but I think for this one we'll go as, oh hell yeah, is this the bloody... Oh god, yeah, we've got the bloody, uh, what were they called? The Samoan Gangster Party or whatever they were called? Hell yeah. Uh, this time for I'm going to play as uh, Paul. Just for a change. Okay. Do we even try and see if we can get a TV deal? Oh, I should have put in ECW pictures as well. Dang it. So what's our first show? This is August, so we have The Doctor is in, and then Natural Born Killers. We have Hardcore TV every Saturday on US syndication, small free. My favourite, my favourite uh, TV channel. So I think we'll start with broadcasting. That's always a good way to go. Broadcasters, well, events and team, no. Broadcasting, there we go. Okay, so that's all of the US. View all broadcasters, will negotiate, yes. How many do you think we'll see? None. Oh, that's more than I thought. Uh, okay. Okay, we can get some interesting coverage, actually. We, I think we only go for the high-risk ones, because we're ECW, obviously. So let's see, we could get, let's see, tiny, t is there a risk? Can I sort by risk? No. Okay, new, medium, 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 high, coverage in Puerto Rico, okay, cool, medium, medium, low, high, high, medium, 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 okay, negotiate, events. You want me to pay money? No, I'm not doing that. Uh, events. And then, what was the other one we could get? It was one of the ones in Puerto, it was in Puerto Rico, wasn't it? Yeah. Okay. Let me check. The one we have. When does that run till? Six months. And we don't currently have TV in Puerto Rico, so get the Puerto Rico one right now. I better win that. In all the regions that they cover, the running to accept exception. So, wait, I, I want to check. I want to check. I don't want to mess it up. Your coverage. So currently... For our TV, we have no coverage in Puerto Rico, and we have medium in Puerto Rico, and tiny and tiny, and very small for television. Is that exclusive? That is an exclusive. What are the popularity requirements? 29 and 5, and we currently, we could maybe get that? Maybe? Maybe? 
59 in Tri-State and 35 in the Mid-Atlantic or New England. Okay, so New England. Uh, uh, let me think. Why, why have I got warnings? Is it just rivals? That's okay. Okay, they have better production quality. That's okay. Because we all have better wrestling. <laughs> uh, right. Right, right, right. Uh, we want a TV deal. With the lads in uh, Puerto Rico. That's broadcasting. Right, lads, we have a deal in Puerto Rico. Right, that's our television, sort it. Should just have curiosity. Okay, so they all have the same thing. Okay. All right, so that's good to know, right? So let's look at our roster, I think. Got Raven is our world champ. Sabu, Shane Douglas, Taz, the Sandman, Tommy Dreamer, Doctor Dave, Terry Gordy, Two Cold Scorpio, Nine One One, Axel Rotten, Big Dick Dudley, Brian Lee. Bubble Ray, Devon, Cronus. <laughs> uh, they are. Cronus, they're tag champs. Uh, Mikey Whipwreck, Mustafa, New Jack, Saturn, Pitbulls, Sammy the Silk, Stevie Richards, uh, Devin Storm, JT Smith, Louis Piccoli, Robert Van Damme. Chubby Dudley, Dances with Dudley, Dog, Hack Myers, Johnny Smith, Little Guido, Matty Smalls, Rose, Supernova, and the Blue Meanie. Wait, Nova isn't the, in the flock yet? Okay. Uh, stables. So we currently have the Raven's Nest, which is uh, those four lads, and then we've got the Dudley family. So Devon is in the is this when he splits off for a little bit? No, he is still a heel. Yeah, you can just go in it, mate. Uh members. Let's add Devon. Dude, I love the Eliminator scene. You have not given out. Oh, he's just a roll. He's a member. Who doesn't love Stevie Richards? He's quite good. Could probably do a Raven's Nest one at some point. Let's have a look at our hidden gems, who we could bring in. Well, obviously. <laughs> Well, that was easy. Has Super Crazy debuted in 96 with Texas Hangman Killer? Who are you? You're someone, aren't you? Tough Tom, that's who it is. And, uh, and his partner was Mean Mike. Adam Bomb. He debuted in 1991, did he? 
So we did. The good thing is, with the way our things work, we literally don't pay anyone unless we book them. So we can have like a massive roster and just not use half of them. Obviously they'll get annoyed, but... So we want to try and avoid that, but oh baby. Steve Kern is Gator? I have... Who's Gator? I don't remember Gator. Just do phenomenal. Don't don't be doing that patter. Uh, yeah, I think I will uh, be setting up a relationship. External relationships. No, we don't. Oh, hell yeah. We're also going to accept people on excursion from FMW. See who they send us. Send us Hayabusa, you cowards. Um, <laughs> okay. you accept that? Oh, he would. We just got Bam Bam on an exclusive written deal. <laughs> There's Ironclad. Ironclad one year deal for Bam Bam. Anthony Durante, who's that? Oh, that's Pitbull number two, yeah. Promising unsigned wrestlers in 1999, or 1996 even. Chavo Jr., uh, I can't, anyways, he's in WCW. Uh, Finley? Oh, Finley could work. Just having like crazy brawls in ECW, that could be fun. I mean, he was kind of doing a crazy man gimmick around this point. Sad face. I wish we could get Eddie Guerrero. But don't worry, you can get Eric Watts. <laughs> the thinking man's Eddie Guerrero. We have Dr. Death. Big friendly Al. We've got him on loan for a show or two, so we're going to job him out, probably. Oh, Mr. JL. Don't worry, I, I won't tell anyone you're Jerry Lynn under that mask. Yeah. Oh yeah, Johnny Grunge is left at this point. Kama could work. Kama could be very fun. I don't know, Greg Gagne had a pretty bad dropkick. I remember that. You know what? No. Hmm. Hell yeah. Uh, great SAS scale, I'll probably bring in. Uh... 
Oh my god, wait, what? <gasps> Herb! <laughs> Bringing him in at some point. I can do a fun thing with him. No, oh, to hire. Put to hire in. Dean Malenko is in WCW. Uh, I don't think he was debuted quite- Oh, no, he has. He has. I might shortlist him. I don't want to bring him in just yet. I, you know, we've got a lot of people. I don't want to bring in too many people. Hmm. Oh, damn it. I wanted Wagner. Uh, hmm. I know who the headhunters are. Just too phenomenal. I don't really want to bring an art bar. Uh, thank you for following, Just Too Phenomenal. Thank you very much. James Mitchell. The thing is, I don't want to bring in... Maybe Handshake, ongoing. They need to be adjusted. But let's just let's just alter that slightly. Exclusive for in four years, two years. A year. Come on, buddy. Seventy-five dollars. <laughs> okay, ongoing handshake. I have not got any plans yet at the moment. Just, uh, you know, going along and seeing how things go. I'm just trying to, you know, do a little chill save, you know? Matt. Oh! <gasps> Dangan! Ooh, men's tail. Yes, please. Uh... <gasps> yes! No, c come to America, please. No, I know it bats an aga so badly. I mean, yeah, but I don't want to do the same kind of things. But actually, PCO is a good show, actually. He's a crazy boy. Paraguayo Jr. was really good when he was like young, like really, really good. I mean, he was really good to his whole career, but like when he's young, he's like amazing when he debuts. What a kick call off, hell yeah! That's the other psychosis, I think. Did we pass Mr. T? I'm not hiring Mr. T. Uh, okay, Funaki. I want to bring in Dick Togo and Kaz Hayashi and Takamichinoku, and we're going to have the goddamn lads. already brought in Funk. Uh, uh, nah, I don't really feel that. T wait, what? 15? 
save you for later. I don't want to assign too many people to begin with, because then you like they'd all, you know, get dumped on your roster. And that would be a bit excessive. Uh, I don't suppose. I mean, worth a shot. Um, Finley. Did I already go for Finley? I did. And is that all I want? No, it isn't. 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 Hell yeah, Samoa, Samoan block party, that's bloody go. Cool. Also Don Callis. Uh, never involve in ring work, foe. No, Kimo is his cousin. He's... Ekmo is Rikishi's brother. Yeah, that's why I'm bringing him in. Bring in Cyrus the Virus. And you know what? He needs... I think he needs someone to manage to clean up ECW. Oh, damn. That would have been so cool. I mean, Lawler is always a good shout. I hope he's not set at that thing where he wouldn't work for us. No, he'd work for us. Good. I know Ekmo's Umaga. Yeah. Uh, is there anyone else we want to bring in? I think that's okay for our first bunch of signings. We have quite a few. I'm just checking we haven't signed like half a tag team or something. Hardys. Okay. Funaki. Takamichinoku. Dick Togo. Oh, I didn't get Men's Tail. Men's Teo and... Is Kazayashi here? Yeah, he is. Nice. Homicide. Now, like I said, I want to save some people. If I, if I sign everyone at once, you have to then try and slot them all in your card and it gets a bit messy. This is like a group. Don Callis with some people. You've got Funk. You've got Bigelow. You know, you've got a few people that would be main eventers, and then you've got some mid-card people to cycle in. <gasps> Carl Ouellette, that could definitely be one of Callus's lads. I tried that. In fact, don't I have that? I already have that. Yeah, we have a talent trading relationship with him. And we'll accept workers from ex uh, excursions, so we'll get them. Uh, we'll be getting sent people by them, which is kind of cool. Send us Megami Kudo, you cowards. Uh, I'm going to quickly shortlist everyone in the WWF. So I'll know if they fire anyone, and the same with WCW. Because we're just going to be the little company that sits in the middle and picks people up as they go across. Uh, view profile, roster, shortlist all. And then... Announcers. So we still just have styles. We'll just have Joey. I know they did for a while, because mine, they're on uh, Barely Legal, there's an M Pro match. In fact, isn't it uh, Blue World Order Japan, as they had them as? Oh, we don't have it in here. You know, we're just going to get it while we're here. Uh, adopt Friendly Attitude, Propose Talent Trading, and I'm going to accept uh, Workers on Excursion from them. 
Oh, fair enough. Do you think we should ask New Japan to send us people on excursion? <laughs> Was it maybe Jin Jinsei Shinzaki, aka Hakushi? He used to get booked a lot in ECW back in the day. Oh, he's unemployed! Not for much longer, he ain't. <laughs> okay, Hakushi's the last guy we're getting at the moment. I mean, that's tempting, though. Um. I mean, we could also bring in J E W -F, F J A W -R, R E W T. So that could be cool. Yeah, we've got a uh, PCO, big friendly Al. I'm really thinking about. I I like the idea of bringing in a bit of a cliche, but I li I like the whole you know anti. I know, I'm, I'm a big fan of Hayabusa phenomenon. I know quite a lot about him. <gasps> I do like the idea of, like, having, like, the network anti-ECW stable. I mean, it's sort of a cliche now, but at this point, that hadn't happened before. Dudley Boys, Dungeon of Doom. <gasps> Nation. Wolfpack. Radicals. <laughs> Woo! Uh, okay, there's none for the different people I want at the moment. Anyway. So that's a whole bunch. Ew. That's a whole bunch of people we have uh, to arrive. So let's. We do need to have storylines. Okay, we need to have at least two over thirty-five. Add storyline: Raven versus Tommy Dreamer. <laughs> there we go. That'll do for the next twenty years. No, we couldn't. We have national syndication at the moment, but we can't get, uh, that only lasts for six months. I'll leave the production for now. Let's multi-advance. Let's just advance. We'll go a day at a time. Ow. Hmm. <gasps> No, I was just going, because oh, I saw Kurt Angle. <laughs> okay, WCW were at war with us. I didn't know that. Philadelphia? I don't know. What? Uh, obviously, we're going to try and sign him, right? Okay, we're not going to get... Bull Nakano going to see MLL, that's cool. All Japan are trying to sign Takayama, that's cool. Mike Kyoda has moved, and so is Johnny Smith. Okay. Oh, great Sasuke. Wow. Removed it from being Booker from his own company. I mean, what we could eventually do, right? If our money gets really bad in-game... Right? Which is a real possibility, because of the way, you know, ECW went down in real life. Ow. Is, well, first of all, we could smash our knee into a uh, steering wheel. Ow. <laughs> uh, you know, we could do all that. We could uh, ask WWF to basically be their developmental. And then we'd get cool people sent down to us, like... 
hillbilly Jim. <laughs> Dude, you're talking to the right guy. Scorpio is my main man. I love Scorpio. Everybody, here comes to Cold Scorpio. He ruled. Uh, I want to check quickly. I forgot to check for someone. Uh, like, I want to see who do we can we get that's above 50 in the tri-state. Just to get that, you know, big in the tri-state people uh, tire. Oh yeah, no, oh, some of these are handshakes. Oh, sick. Uh, I'm already in negotiations with Gamma. <gasps> Lou Albano! <gasps> the one-man gang? The Tonka? Ricky Steamboat? Oh, he's retired. <laughs> I won't lie, I got real excited there. I got real excited by Ricky Steamboat. Oof. What a, what a rogues gallery. Uh, we could probably do something with Brian Clark. I am absolutely not doing that just too phenomenal. No. That's, no. I think Brian Clark could be a fun member of Cyrus's group. Like, that's like, he could be like Cyrus's bodyguard. Just standing beside Cyrus looking like massive. <laughs> that can work quite well. Bring in Rook Oh no wait, we didn't bring Matt Born in. Yeah, Born again, again. <laughs> born again, again. As he's more colloquially called. The Undertaker has turned evil. Most uncool. Kuniaki Kobayashi won the IWGP Junior Heavyweight uh, Championship. Tag 4? Wait a minute. Someone's copied and pasted from Cage Match. Uh, Blackout formed by Tommy Rich Spellbinder and Reggie B. Fine. Wow. What a, what a bunch of lads. Let's see what they did on Raw. Wow. Mankind and The Undertaker are a team now. Who was teaming with Savio Vega? But who was, uh... Who was he teaming with? I don't know. Who? Uh, huh? HBK, Michael Kays, and Aldo Montoya. Oh my god. A Portuguese guy and two assholes. <laughs> Bradshaw's getting a hockey gimmick? Sorry, did I miss something? Was he in the segment with the goon? No, he's teaming with the goon. Oh, yeah. The goon. Uh, complete signing. Complete signing. The Hardys are faces all day, every day. Uh, Funaki, heel. Don Callis, heel. Uh, Men's Teo, heel. Kushi would probably be a face. Like, his cool gimmick would get moved over. Ah, oh, yeah, I know about that with Aldo. I was shooting that a while ago, which is very strange to think. Barry Windham could actually maybe be a big, sh uh, good shout. You know, Barry Windham as part of like an anti ECW stable could be fun. Uh, anyway, I want to go to those people we just hired. Don Callis. Uh, I'm not going to call you that. I literally said never to involve in ring. I'm going to Cyrus the virus. Wait. Oh. 
Okay, is there a Cyrus picture? No. Dawn. Okay, there's one Dawn Callus picture. Uh, save. No. City Slicker? No. Uh... It's kind of in the middle, but uh, that's kind of fun. The gimmick was sensor. I'm just going to make him anti hardcore specifically, it's more of like a Weasley kind of character. I think instead of him necessarily being a network person, because we're not on a national network, I think he's more like we base him on what was his name? Where is he? Uh, oh, this isn't going to be here. Uh, uh, wait a second. This lad. No, he's not available yet. I think it. I think it actually isn't until ninety eight you'll pop up. Hang on, let's have, let's have a quick look at the data, just out of interest. Kurt Angle, call me Kurt Angle. What? Call me Kurt Angle. What? Yeah, he doesn't actually debut to nineteen ninety eight, so we've got a while for Angle. Yeah, that's why. That's why we're making him. So we're making Cyrus him, because no one likes him. But people like Cyrus, so we have to get around that. Stables. Add stable. Kai N. Tai. D. X. Taka. Oh, we don't have him yet. Oh, wait. I'll wait till they've all arrived. Uh, Men's Teo. That's a funny way to spell Terry Boy. Oh, it's his nickname. No, I, I want Terry Boy as his ring name. Hmm. Uh, teams. Add new team. Add team. Add new team. Remember who the Miracle Violence Connection wrestled around this time? Well, we don't really have the BWO yet. Just too phenomenal. Oh. Oh, Rickety's boy, Craig Pittman. That's Rickety's boy right there. New team, Scott Norton and Ice Stream. Oh, that was a real team. Uh, here we go, Mike Awesome. Super crazy. Make it my face. Lance Storm. Taka Michinoku. Dick Togo. Ekmo. No, uh, Pillman's uh, just sitting in the WWF at this point. His broken ankle. Uh, Kaz Hayashi. Which means I think we now have everyone for... Uh, I think that's everyone for uh, this uh, stable. I would have a Shu Ryu picture. No. Let's get a picture of him. Shouldn't he be in ECW to November 1996?
No, June 1996. He moved to uh, the WWF. Now, nah, Razor, the, the baldies we're saving for later. Hell yeah, Bam Bam's in. So is Funley. So is the Funker. So is Carl Oulette. Ooh. Ooh. Conan's working out of AAA. That's interesting. The new team of the Sultan and Isaac Yankum, the Jet Set. Wow, the the names it comes up for with, with teams sure are special, aren't they? They sure are unique. Oh, uh, the first. Uh, Junior heavyweight champion has uh, moved to uh, El Japan. Wing Alliance have lost a member. Wow. <laughs> Wing Kanemura got kicked out of the stable called the Wing Alliance. <laughs> That's kind of harsh. I mean, I'm not being funny. He should be a, you know, the stable needs to have Wing Kanemura in it. Kama, yes. Okay, okay, uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. If I'm correct, our next episode... I really don't want to bring in Vampiro, just to phenomenal. I don't want to bring in Vampiro. Our next advance here will be our first show and our first episode of Hardcore TV. So I think I'll actually call an end to the episode here for the people on YouTube. Uh, thanks for watching everyone that uploaded the YouTube upload list uh, remember like, comment, and subscribe yeah, professional and uh, go to twitch.tv slash mildly underscore amusing and follow the channel you could be watching this live you could be watching this live and be like whoa, Terry Funk he's going to debut a legend gimmick I don't I don't, I don't care, just do phenomenal I'm just going to do it, I'm just going to do what I want they also didn't bring in PCO, but <laughs> bye YouTube, bye everyone say bye to YouTube in the Twitch chat am I taping multiple episodes of Cardcore TV? You know I didn't even look no, one at a time I know that I know that might be what they used to do, but we're just going to leave it the way it is bye YouTube, bye <laughs>